So the little unit that I've bought is 124 square meters, it's small. So one of the major spaces that I'm going to be overhauling here is the kitchen, which I'm really, really excited about. Because for me, the kitchen is absolutely the heart of the home. It is a, a room that's important to so many people. So it is the one room that I'm really spending my time, my energy and my money on. I think in terms of budgeting, it is one of the spaces that one needs to, to really budget for. It's probably one of the more hefty capital outlays, especially because of the fact that you're using timber, you may be using, um, you know, Caesar stone tops, you know, fancy cookers and things. But, and I want to create a space that's just inviting and oh, clean, modern, and, and that you want to spend time in and that people want to come and congregate to when someone's cooking a meal. That's, that's the vision. One of the items that I just had to have was a white Caesar stone top. The, the whole kitchen is going to be white with gold accents. I want it to be feminine, I want it to be luxe, I want it to be classy. Um, and for me, those were a couple of non-negotiables. I'm gonna take you on that journey with me. As you can see, I'm walking through a tunnel of the most beautiful slabs of Caesar stone, The products with the little yellow um, the yellow stickers are the Caesar stone slabs. So I'm going for a 20 mil. This is actually the exact one. It's called Pure White. And I, I think I'm really, really happy with my choice. I have picked up a piece of the Pure White um, Caesar stone top. I just want a confirmation that this was the right color. Um, I'm so happy with it. I know that this is the one. So this is the end of day one. Oh my goodness, ah, it's all happening. The kitchen island, I suppose that will run a little bit in front of that wall line. We're stealing a teeny bit of space, so that will run there. We are exactly a week into the project. As you can see, this is very much a building site. I am absolutely amazed at the progress that we've made already. about to walk in and see the carcass installation, um, which means major progress and that we're reaching the final points as well. It has been a long eight weeks, but we are finally here. It's still, if I'm honest, probably only about 95% done. There were two, two decisions I made that very much guided my aesthetic for this. The first being my beautiful Caesar stone top. These tops are absolutely magic. They create such a gorgeous, classy backdrop, and I'm just obsessed with the way this turned out. The next thing that was an absolute non negotiable for me and my pierce de resistance was my Smeg six top white cooker. Those two white elements in the Caesar stone tops and the Smeg were the two bits that helped me bring this design to life. Thank you so much for coming on this little tour with me. I kind of can't believe that we are finally at this point. It feels in ways like it's been the longest time, but also just the shortest time. And thanks so much for watching.